before we even get into this video, I just want to say thank you. I was recently on the YouTube trending page as like the creator on the rise. Ever since then, I literally got so many followers, so many new faces on this channel. And I just want to say how grateful I am, how much I love you and appreciate all your support. Just all the comments, the sweet comments and messages, literally. I read every single one of them and none of them go unseen. Appreciate every single word that you guys say, every message. I just love you guys so much and I just want to extend my gratitude because I literally am so grateful for your support every single day. For today's video, I am finally packing and prepping to go to Europe. I'm going to Italy and I actually leave in a few days, so I have a lot to do before I leave. I'm going to be doing a mini glow up. I'm going to pack. I'm going to show you guys all of the outfits that I bought for this trip because trust me, there's a lot. I am just so excited for this trip. This is the first time I'm going to be going to Europe, so I'm very nervous, but I'm very excited, like so excited. I've been waiting for this trip for months now and just getting ready for a trip, especially like a big trip like this in the summertime is just like my favorite thing. It's like one of the best things about going on the trip is obviously preparing for it. Coming on here to properly intro this video because I did a very poor job, but hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a pack and prep video for my trip for Italy. I'm going to be doing a mini glow up and show you guys all of the things that I'm bringing on my trip to Italy this summer. I'm super excited for this trip and I can't wait to show you guys the vlogs. I'm literally kicking, screaming. I am just so giddy because I can't wait to show you these vlogs. But I hope you guys like this video and let's get into it. But right now I'm all ready. I'm all dressed and I'm going to go meet my friend for a nail appointment. We made a nail appointment together and we're going to get our nails done together. I still don't know what I want, but these nails are literally so long. I've had these for like a month or something. Don't forget if you guys aren't already to subscribe to the channel and go follow me on Instagram and TikTok because I'm going to be posting every single day on this trip. If you guys want all of the Euro summer content, go follow me. I'll have everything linked down below. But let's go to this nail appointment. We have like five minutes to look on Pinterest and see what kind of nails that we want because we still haven't Wait. decided. Let's we'll see, look at, I just searched summer nails. Oh, and like I'm on there. <laughs> the first thing that comes up. I'm trying to decide if I should do any like fun colors, but I think I'm just gonna do white fringe tips. Like, no, kind of really lame. Really That's kind of really lame, but Wait, like. Look at those are, cool. Those are cute. Oh, I'm like thinking something like this, like with sparkles. Okay, that's, I like yeah. that. That's fun. That's Should I do fun. that? Oh. It may cost me like $200. <laughs> I'll do it. You're going to Italy. It doesn't matter. <laughs> do it for Italy. Do it do for it the for, plot. Do it for the Spend plot. Spend all money for the plot. <laughs> They look so, so good. good. This is so Italy. I'm like a new person when I get nails on. <laughs> Very last minute, but we are going to do some last minute shopping before I leave because I just want to make sure that I have everything that I need and I will have any excuse to go shopping. <laughs> Hey guys, it's a little bit later now. Alexis just dropped me off to be home. I'm home now. I got situated a little bit, ate a little something because I was starving. But now I have to do the next process in the preparing to go to Italy and that is not so hot girl. It's getting an oil change. I have been putting it off to the very last minute and when I say very last minute, like literally we leave in two days and I need to get an oil change before I leave. But that's what we're on our way to doing right now. And you know what? It is very very hot girl to get your oil change. It's very hot girl to be responsible to keep up with your car maintenance. That's what I'm gonna tell myself. We're gonna get going. <laughs> Hello? Well, I literally forgot my keys, so I'll see you guys <laughs> at the oil change place. Fun fact about me is that I absolutely hate getting my oil change. They open the door for me. <laughs> Neat. Yeah, just an oil change. Getting an oil change is so not like a vibe. I'm choosing to make an aesthetic. I have a 
super exciting haul to show you guys and I just want to firstly thank Revolve for sponsoring this video. Everything I'm about to show you is from Revolve and I'm going to have everything linked down below so everything I show you guys is going to be linked right at the top of my description box. Also taking all of these outfits to Italy with me when I leave for my trip so I am just so excited so make sure you guys are going to go follow me so you see how I style them. Starting off with the best dress that I think I'm going to be wearing on my trip is the Peyton Maxi dress and if you guys know me I usually only go for like neutrals and very like pastel colors and never like something like hot pink like this but when I saw this it literally like spoke to me does that make sense I love the neckline it's this clasp closure that just goes around your neck so it's like super high up then the bottom is literally stunning and the dress ends like a little bit below my knees the rest of it is just like this fringe and all I want to do is just like move around in it because it's so fun this one is called the da Daria dress it has these cute little tie straps which I really like because if you need to make it readjustable you can and it just looks cute because you can make cute little bows it also has a zipper back which is super nice to have and also the best part about this dress it literally the dress has pockets I absolutely love that about that dress it's everything that I want and more I can't wait to have like a cute little shopping day in this dress I think this is gonna be perfect for that I also got these super cute shorts these are called the dawn shorts also from the LPA brand so cute and if you guys look close enough you guys can kind of see the design that's on it and it has this cute little scalloping detail on the bottom I feel like in the summertime I see so many people wear these even to wear with like a basic like tank top or something I think it's already so cute because the shorts just like do all the work for you spice up the outfit just because they are like the main thing of the show crochet has to be one of the biggest trends that I'm seeing this summer especially cute crochet like cover-up dresses I think this dress is the perfect length I am actually 5'2 so it's not too long and it's not too short and I also really like this dress because it has a leg slit so if you guys are looking for a super cute cover-up that is really good quality and like so perfect for the summertime I definitely recommend this one again I'm gonna have all of the pieces I just talked about and mentioned in my description box right at the top so you guys can shop through my revolve links make sure you guys are following me on Instagram and TikTok to see how I style all these pieces so you know I'm gonna be taking so much content and posting pictures and all of them but let's get back into packing because we have a lot to do before we leave <laughs> I probably should have done the talking section of this video without these teeth whitening strips in but I just wasn't thinking officially a day before I leave so there's a lot to get done I already took a shower this morning I scraped off all of my self tan I just did my skincare I shaved my face like dermaplane my face and it's like one of my favorite beauty routines I do and right now I am just whitening my teeth with these crest 3d white strips I have a whole checklist that I made yesterday I'm talking so weird right now I'm so sorry still have the self tan so the next time you see me I will be nice and tanned so this is the suitcase I'm going to be bringing it's the base travel bag with the mini weekender and I have traveled with it and I absolutely love it the suitcase has a lot of storage a lot of space hopefully it fits everything that I have to bring on this seven day trip I think everything's gonna fit perfectly fine I am very notorious for overpacking to avoid that I actually made a PowerPoint presentation literally of every single outfit that I'm going to be wearing on this trip like I am on top of my shit this trip just because I don't want to like be like unprepared you know like I don't want to be unprepared when I get there I want to know every little single detail I'm very type a if you haven't noticed but I'm gonna start packing now I have everything hung up on this wardrobe right behind me of all of the outfits that I'm bringing I also have some things coming in the mail still and I literally leave tomorrow morning tell me why I just like haven't gotten them yet it literally said that it was gonna ship in three days and it's been five cross your fingers that they come in the mail before I leave tomorrow morning yeah just like pray for me here's everything on the wardrobe that I'm going to be bringing I also have a ton of stuff down here and like random t-shirts and stuff here is just like a quick little general overview of all the outfits a lot of white but also some color in there these are gonna be all the shoes that I'm bringing I also have a pair of heels that I hopefully will not regret wearing I'm bringing two different types of slides these ones are super cute and have this little woven like fabric and also these from Dolce Vita I thought were so adorable and they're just like plain white so they would go with pretty much everything and then also 
also I'm bringing this huge bag of swimsuits. I think I have like five swimsuits in here. But that is pretty much everything that I'm going to be bringing. I'm very organized this time around for this trip. Minus the things that are coming in the mail, hopefully tomorrow. Hopefully tomorrow. No, they are coming tomorrow in the morning before I leave. I'm also bringing my mini weekender as my personal item. And I've traveled with this before and it fits just perfectly underneath the seat. So if you guys are thinking of purchasing this, just know it fits. I have for the last few weeks just thrown a bunch of stuff in here that I've been purchasing. The first thing I just got is the La Rose Pose SPF 60 sunscreen for your body and face. This is the most important thing to bring with you on vacation. You should always be wearing your sunscreen. The dry shampoo from Not Your Mother's and then I also am bringing some hairspray. Favorite thing about traveling is like getting all the cute mini versions of all these products. Just got some deodorant. This is just the Old Spice Fiji deodorant. The best scent. I absolutely love it. Decided to get some downy wrinkle eraser. I saw a bunch of people like using this as little life hacks for travel on TikTok so I decided to pick it up. You're supposed to be able to just like spray it on and it de-wrinkles your shirt which is like perfect because my clothes are going to be stuffed in my suitcase. So bringing this Crest mouthwash. Other things that I have in here I have some of my favorite toothpaste. I have this travel like Tylenol. So I've got this cute little mini brush and if you guys look like the little brush part it looks like a little like tropical leaf. I'm also bringing two of these face masks to do on the plane because I'm gonna have a little airplane like spa moment. I would say is very essential is to pack the snacks. They're so good. These are from Target. And then I also got this like plant-based beef jerky. It's just the Beyond Meat. And I just packed these for Joe because they're his favorite. They're like peanut butter M&Ms. So that is everything that I have in my weekender so far. I'm gonna be like putting all my electronics and stuff in here. done packing all of my carry-on suitcase and I have all these shoes to pack and I was going to put them in my carry-on but then I remembered that this is the best thing about having the mini weekender. Underneath there's like this little section that you can detach and it's perfect for putting shoes like any extra things. They're going to save me so much space in my carry-on so I'm going to put all of my shoes that I'm bringing at the bottom of here and then I'll have way more room in here to just like leave more space. <laughs> We're at the airport now. We just got to our gate, but we got some food. We don't leave for another like two hours. Airport food review. Vegan Southwest wrap. Let's have a taste. I don't know how to open it. Yum. Looks so good. It smells good. 